spiritual gifts without spiritual maturity causes what? Spiritual confusion. Spiritual gifts without spiritual maturity causes spiritual confusion. Have you ever wondered when a Christian who's full of the gift of the Holy Spirit does something and you're like, and they say they are Christians? Yeah? And he said he's born again. But he just healed the sick. He just cast that demon. Gift of the Holy Spirit in, in quantum. He's just raised the dead. But he slaps you in anger. And when that happens, that lack of spiritual maturity happens, the next thing that goes through your mind is that, I don't, I, I, I don't understand it. How is it that he could be that way and at the same time be this way? Spiritual gifts without spiritual maturity causes spiritual confusion. And that's why people are struggling when they see pastors fail or anyone make a mistake or any vicar makes a mistake or priest or father and all those things. Why is that? The people are confused. Why? Because they're attributing spiritual gifts to being spiritual maturity and the two are not the same at all. You may have people who are spiritually, completely spiritually matured, but not even functioning so much in the spiritual gifts. Or even if they do, they hide it. You will never know. They are the kind of people maybe that will come and someone is being sick and they will just already prayed with Jesus and Jesus said, touch the person and they will be healed. And instead of coming and just making it obvious, they will just come and do this and just walk past. And that person gets healed, don't know why they got healed. But that person is so spiritually mature, they don't care. They don't, they don't want that attention at all. It doesn't matter. That's what spiritual maturity does to you. You come to the point where functioning in the gift of the Holy Spirit means nothing. What matters the most is the love for the people. It burns your heart and pains you to see people suffer because that's more important. Love consumes you than the showmanship that follows with gift of the Holy Spirit. That brings to question sometimes why we should be too moved when there's a lot of showmanship with the gift of the Holy Spirit. We should learn that those two things are not the same. Am I accusing and condemning people who show the gift of the Holy Spirit? No! I'm saying we need to learn to be matured in understanding this and not be confused. Don't be confused when people function so much in the gift of the Holy Spirit but they abandon you and they reject you and they don't love you is because they are not spiritually matured and I don't care how big their name is we all need to be spiritually matured amen turn to someone and say desire spiritual maturity above spiritual gifts say that to someone please very important desire that more 